On a supersized Sunday in New England, the Boston University men's basketball team opened the day's events looking for a season sweep against the Lafayette Leopards. It was a back and forth first half as Eric Johnson came off the bench and ignited the Terrier offense, hitting three from beyond the arc. Jolice can be that guy at a season high 18 last time out against Arnold. Johnson, three on the way, cutting forward for the triple. Have to really look to double in the post, so good around the basket, the Leopards. Eight straight for Lafayette, Johnson. He'll try it again, that sounds pretty, ripping the core. The score was tied seven times and had five different lead changes in the first half as Nick Lindner scored 13 first half points to give Lafayette a lead 41 to 40. Starting to see them trading threes, an immediate answer. BU was looking for their first one of the season when trailing at the half and they dialed up the defense in the second half forcing Lafayette to miss their first 14 shots. And scampering back, Jalice. Long up. Terriers up full. Lafayette looking for the first points of the second half. That won't get it done. Well, Max Mahoney scored a career high 12 points off the bench to give BU a double figure lead. Foreman. Oh, Mahoney scoring in for the bucket. Excellent pass by Foreman. Better catch and finish by the young freshman. Will Goss converted on four from beyond the arc as the Terriers ran away with it 75 to 58 the final. And they have gotten it done. Lafayette goes to a 1-3-1 one, one zone out of the timeout. And Goff solves it from the corner. BU is now 8-4 in conference play and 10-3 and at home. Joe Jones won his 102nd game at BU, which puts him alone in second place on BU's all-time list, passing Mike Jarvis. The Terriers will head to Washington, D.C. to take on American Wednesday night starting at 7.30 p.m. That game can be heard at 7.15 with the pregame show on the Terrier Sports Radio Network.